Today we're going to be visiting one of my favorite video games to play back in the good old days. What do I mean by the good old days? I mean the days where I was in school playing video games on a laptop when I should be studying and or doing work. It's funny because I know my schooling years as the games that I played in those years. This was like a year 10 kind of game, I'm, I'm thinking. But I didn't play this game in school, I played it at home. I actually remember playing this one with my dad, it was the only video game that my dad actually really liked playing. So he'll know what this is if he's watching. Also, hi mom, I know you're watching this because you watch all my videos. So what is this video game you might be asking? That game would be Insane Aquarium Deluxe. Oh, I remember the first time I ever played this game. Just like the good old days, except the aspect ratio is really bad. So back in the day, we didn't have Steam. So when you wanted to download video games off the internet, it came with like these trials to like try and get you to buy the game. And my parents are really weird and they always thought every site was a scam so they wouldn't put their credit card on nothing, except RuneScape after I begged for about three years. They thought everybody was going to steal their credit card information. It's, it's funny. It's cute. So pretty much the only time I was actually able to play this game was on the 30 to 60 minute trials that they let you load the game up but the trick was that if you didn't close the game then you could play for as long as you wanted because it only logged your hours every time you closed the game and so i remember like i stayed up all night trying to get as like far as i could in the game because it's like it goes for a while so what exactly is insane aquarium you might be asking it's a fish game and for some reason i love me some fish games back in the day so many good ones so many bangers you have fish it's it's like, oh, I know a game I'm going to play on the channel soon. That was my favorite game. I just, I got to write this one down. I got to write it down. No, I'll write it down later. Favorite game I ever played. I love playing old games. If you guys want to play more old games, let me know. I love old games. They're so good. So you have fish. It's an aquarium. You, it's like an aquarium simulator. You feed your fish, but wait, but wait, there's aliens. What will the aliens do? They will eat your fish. And the goal is to get all three egg pieces, get a new pet, you pretty much get it. Oh my god, this game is so much more laggier and bad than I imagined back in the day. Why is it like this? Alrighty, do not fear everybody. I have fixed it and we are now feeding our fish. So these are my guppies, alright? These are my lovely fish. Have a look at my aquarium. I spent a lot of money on it. To be fair, the game actually did cost five bucks, which is a bit of a steal. I like the thing. So you feed your fish. Guess what? They grow. Unbelievable. Can't believe it. And what you do with that? You, you buy more fish. But how do you get money? Well, guess what? Your fish are made of money. That's right. They poop out coins. So it's as simple as that. It's a very addictive game. You feed your fish. Everything is peaceful. The music, peaceful. You just click on the screen, you feed your fish, and then you profit. It's as simple as that. You can't go broke. And then you get two guppies. You get two that give out silver coins. And you think it's over there? Ha, huh, no. It's not over there. You see, when you feed your silver guppies enough, they actually, uh, what I like to call, evolve. Um, but uh, you gotta wait another another feed because they they need more food. I think this next one. And would you have a look at that? He has evolved and he is now pooping out gold coins. That's right, gold coins. All right. But you make sure. You see how they lose their color there? They're actually dying, just like me inside. No, I'm kidding. <laughs> But as you can see here, there's a lot of options, but you unlock them as the games go by. And you build up enough money to buy the egg pieces because the egg gets a new pet. And, oh no, quick, get the food! And sometimes the other fish eat the food and then the other fish dies and it's really sad for everyone involved. So as you can see here, I'm gonna buy an egg piece. I bought an egg piece. I gotta get my money. I gotta buy another one and then I buy the third piece. And what have I found? Oh my god, it's the clam! Oh no, it's the snail. Damn, there's a clam. Don't worry. No, there's a clam. Yeah, but they're the same ones every time. It's not like a mystery box. You get the same one every round. It's like set. So Stinky the Snail. Snails roam around the bottom of your tank catching any coins you may have missed. Now, I like to call this one the noob one because you never miss your coins unless you're bad at the game. So anyway, you go back to tank one, two. You're still chilling. Your tank looks beautiful. Look how good it looks. It looks so good. And yeah, you're just sitting here feeding. Uh, now, obviously, whatever the hell his name is, Snail, will we'll pick up coins when they go near him. So he's trying to like stay underneath them so that he won't miss any of the coins. So look at him, he'll go straight for it. Oh, cheers, mate, you're the best. Don't even need to click the coins anymore. You've always got it. Yeah, get him, mate, go, go, go. Sometimes you can miss them though, if like he's here and then like a coin spawns here, he will miss it. Nah, I got it, mate, baited ya. Um, so yeah, we probably should get some more guppies as we go because guppies are good investments of coin. I don't think you need too many though. Here we go, guys. This is when the peaceful experience, everything is ruined. Danger, a vicious alien is about to enter your tank. Defeat it with your laser weapon. Did I mention we get lasers? Yes. 
We get lasers. Click to continue. Enemy approaching. It's like, sound the alarms. It's about to go down. All right. Get to the chopper, fish. Get to the chopper. There's the alien. Okay, you gotta focus him because he goes in the other direction. And then you get a diamond. Like, like someone called Drizzy because we're diamonds on us and they're dancing. Uh, it's like Minecraft. Find the diamonds, you know? Like, you just gotta find them. Oh, see, look at that. He missed that. Can I fire my snail? All right, I gotta feed these guys. So yeah, you can upgrade your food quality. Um, so, I mean... Yeah, you can make your food better. I don't really know what it does. They grow quicker, I'm pretty sure. And then you can upgrade by how many you can spam at once. So at the moment, I can only have one piece of food on the screen. Uh, but if I buy this, I can have two on the screen at a time. Look, so I'm gonna get the pill, show you guys. I'm now not feeding them food, like some crappy little food. I'm feeding them pills, boys. Like, I'm getting genetically modified fish. And let's just get as many as I can. See, the problem with more fish is that the aliens can't eat your fish. And they don't even need to, like, sit there for a while. They just hit you, hit your fish, and the fish is dead. It's telling me to upgrade more for my food quality, but I don't think I need it. I think it's a scam. Oh, that's the other good thing with the food is that they get, they don't get as hungry. Like... They'll be there for ages, you know? Now, I don't think the gold coin is the final evolution of the fish. They go higher. Battle tip. Shoot the alien's head to push it downwards. Shoot its tail to deflect it up. Everybody get your hard hats. It's about to go down again. Here we go. All right, snail. You get the money. I'll get the alien. He's going to kill something here. No! Don't you dare eat any of my fish! No! Oh, that fish owes me its life, I swear. You nearly died there, buddy. All right, so let's get these egg pieces and get out of here. The only thing I hated about this game was that you spend so long on your tank and then it would all be over and you had to start over again. It was kind of a bit of a buzzkill because it's like you worked so hard to get your fish to where they are and it's like you're just flushing them down the toilet where the aliens are at because it doesn't matter anymore. But yeah, I used to spend so much time here just tending to my fish and let's buy that egg piece didn't mess around this time nico the oyster this is the guy who used to run a lot of the time he produces a pearl and they can sell it for a lot of money it's a pretty good gig he chills out over here um just swagging out and look at that we're on a new level i can't believe this game was only 18 megabytes like the game the graphics looked better in my mind but i mean obviously not right now they look pretty bad so there you go watch ready i think you get like 100 bucks for this you get 250 bucks holy crap see it's like baller money, dude. That's three guppies I can buy with a pearl. And he does it like every 30 seconds or a minute. I don't know. I forgot. I don't, I don't know this game. It's so peaceful, man. The music just makes me want to vibe out. Alrighty, here we go. We've unlocked something else here. Now, this guy over here, as it suggests with the name, he's a carnivore. Now, guys, what do carnivores do? Carnivores eat meat. Just like this alien who's about to get wrecked. No one's taken any of my fish alive. I guess they're probably gonna eat them, but no, don't go for it! No, oh, don't go for it! No! Oh. oh! And just like that, the guppy died. Now, I hope you left a like rating down below for my fellow guppy that has died, but I wanna tell you now that that's not even the worst. Aliens aren't the only thing that eat your own fish. Welcome, everybody, to the carnivore. Now, the carnivore will not eat normal foods. You see, he will actually... He, he drops diamonds. Okay, did I mention that? He drops diamonds. But you'll see here, he's gone a bit weird. He's gone off. That's because he needs to eat guppies. He's like an alien fish, if you will. He'll, he'll eat our fish, but he'll drop diamonds. So it's like, you know, it's whatever. He'll only eat the small ones, so I don't have to worry about him eating the other goldfish. But uh, you can see here, I can upgrade my weapon. Pretty much, I think that's the biggest scam they can do in this video game. You don't need to buy um, the weapon upgrades if you're good with the clicks. You don't need it. You just don't need it, boys. I'm telling you now. Yeah, I'm gonna up my investments here and get two more of these babble. Oh no, so this is what happens. If you pull all of your money, and then the bad things come. Oh no, boys, eat, eat, eat up, eat up, eat up. Oh no, don't eat the carnivores. Don't eat the carnivores. Don't even think about it. Get the diamond. Yeah, all right. See, they eat carnivores. Bang, hey, gone, disappear, doesn't exist anymore because they've just eaten it. I don't know how I've managed to maintain all these guys and keeping them alive, but I have. All righty, and there we go. Just me and the boys chilling out. They all ate all the guppies and it's just these two big guys. Uh, now, if we have another crisis, I will buy another one when the crisis comes. But yeah, for the most part, it's pretty easy breezy. Just chilling here, getting diamonds. I'm pretty, like, it's more diamonds than I get in Minecraft. All right, so we're gonna build up the whole 6K. You can't sell your fish, which is a little unfortunate. It would be great to sell them and just cash out. Doesn't work like that. But you can go ahead and uh, I'll upgrade my weapon once because it doesn't really matter because I can finish the game anyway. Uh, I wanna show what happens when my fish die though. You ready for this tragic event to unfold? I'm not gonna, I'm gonna purposely not feed my fish. Call Peta, I don't care. 
I'm gonna do it. And they're dead. Look at that. Eat the dead fish. I dare you. I don't care. Eat every fish. Eat the dead one. Can he eat the dead one? He can't eat the dead one. Well, that's hilarious. Oh, no! But I have money. Well, today I learned that money isn't everything. If your fish die, you die too. Even if you have enough money to finish the game. I also just realized it costs five bucks to give them food. Damn, this is some expensive food. Like, really. It's five bucks for each pellet. What are we feeding these things? That's fine though, it's just another day in the business. We can rebuild, it's just not that hard, you know? You just get your egg pieces and you don't buy too many guppies and you just win. But everything's spread apart, don't you dare even think about it. I love it when the fish are just that suicidal, they run into the alien. That's what triggers me. Like, come on guys. Where's your instinct for survival? Don't run to the alien, run to the carnivore. And there we go, just some peaceful fish and chill. All right, I'm calling it now. You get some pregnant one. You get Prego, the fish. Nah, damn it, the swordfish. Itchy helps you by attacking aliens when they appear. So the thing is, you can only have three pets at a time. So after we get our fourth one, we have to throw one of these out. I normally throw out the swordfish or the snail, because, oh, the snail's handy, but the swordfish is really just not that needed. I like to think I'm good at taking aliens out as it is. If there was a pet that could, you know, control the AI of the fish to not be suicidal, I'd definitely get that one. I'm trying to remember what else there is. There's food, food quantity, carnivore, something, weapons, and then the egg piece, of course. All right, wait, I need to feed this guy. You can't feed- Whoa! Whoa, different alien. Help me out, Itchy. Itchy, help me out, boy. Help me out. Do your damn- Whoa, this guy was tanky as hell. Damn, Itchy the swordfish did nothing there. I hope he's named Itchy. That would be really rude for me to get his name wrong. But yeah, I don't know what this piece was. I'm trying to remember. Hold down mouse button to... Oh! You can use the mouse button to feed. Maybe if I buy the um the weapon, it might give me something? So as you can see there, you just get a cooler looking weapon. But it doesn't do anything. I think the blaster might be different. Alright, let's test out this new... Let's test out my new gun, eh? Let's do it. And there we go. We're doing more damage. Different lasers. Don't run into the fish! Ooh. <laughs> he ran. He was going for the food and he got caught in the way by the carnivore. He got he had he got eaten on an empty stomach. That's just sad. Yo, I hate it when fish like this guy in the bottom right are sitting on the bottom so that they literally just drop the coins instantly. Grinds my gears. Alright, now it's starting to get to a point in the game where there's just so much going on that you don't know what's going on. It's kind of annoying, I won't lie. But it makes it means that you are successful at growing fish. All right, now I've doubled down. Oh, right when bad things are about to happen. That's always great. Oh, how many carnivores will we lose in this battle? Get the diamonds. Oh, we haven't lost one yet. Oh, perfect. No, 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 no. Yes, no, no, yes. Didn't lose a single one, but I need to feed him. This is intense. So many diamonds. Diamonds on me dancing. Oh my God, such success. Much fish, very insane aquarium. Yo, I want to see how many is pushing the limit of carnivores. I'm gonna order 10 more. Gotta get the guppies. It's like the stock market. You gotta supply and demand. Gotta make sure these guys stay fed. Everybody gotta stay fed. Wait, I lost a fish somewhere. I don't know where, but I lost a fish. I can't click the diamonds. More! I need more! And at a point, you'll get to a max where you can't have any more fish on the field. Oh my God, so much diamonds. So much diamonds. Woo! Dude, I, I think this is more diamonds than I've ever got in my Minecraft career total. Much success, very fish. So addicting. If only there was, like, records for this. Oh my god, there's so many. Let's get more. We must buy more. Feed! Feed my carnivores! Oh, now see, this is where you just lose no matter what. Make sure to get as many diamonds as you can before these guys all die. Oh, someone's gonna die. Oh, I can't buy fish right now. Wait, I gotta buy fish before the others die. Yep, leave them alone. Yeah. Bye, 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 bye. Oh, and no carnivores were harmed in the process. That's amazing. But we need more. We need more. And this is how you break your computer. But so many die. Oh no, we lost a carnivore. He won. Oh no, we're losing carnivores. We're losing carnivores. Get more guppies. Invest in more guppies. We're losing them. We're losing them. Buy more. Invest. Reinvest. This is chaos. But I love it. Oh no, I've reached a limit. I have no money. Must get more money it, and reinvest. Who needs pearls? More guppies! Yo, this snail is gonna hit me up later and I'll be like, I've been working overtime. And I'll be like, you're still fired. Dude, this is 
So satisfying, I can't even really describe it, if I'm gonna be honest with you. Oh no! Must reinvest, 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 reinvest! Guppies, 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 guppies! Oh my god, they're all done! Okay, if we buy it, we must feed them. So many dead guppies! Oh my god, everyone's gonna die! Nobody lives here. I want a surplus of guppies, and I need a way to feed the guppies. Just sad at this point. Alright, screw it, I'm out. Yeah, I just had to buy out there. And then we got Prego the Mama Fish. Helps populate a tank by giving birth to a new guppy every so often. And then he goes, oh, which ones do you want? And then you go, this one, this one, and this one, because the other one sucks. Alright, so this is the last tank. So the levels go from, like, 1-5, and then they go to 2-1. So this is the last level in this tank. So we're gonna go out with a bang. I wanna know what this last option is. I don't know what it is. Look at that! He's about to, she's about to give birth! She's about to give birth! And then, bang. She, she literally farted that guppy out. I don't know if you heard that, but she literally farted the guppy out. And the thing is, somehow she gets pregnant again. I don't know how. Just behind the scenes. Maybe this, maybe this oyster's doing something behind the scenes of the snail. But she getting pregnant every like 30 seconds. So I don't know how that works. Prego the mama fish. Um, definitely on something. Alright, high stakes now. I don't want to lose any of my good fish. Because otherwise it takes long enough. Oh, we just got a big one. My big fish are they? Oh look, I just realized that this I just realized that the snail goes away like a little girl. And it comes back. And see this is the cool thing, is that if you have Prego the Mama Fish, she just given out guppies, and then the carnivore just eats them. It's kind of really sad if you think about it. She's just walking around watching her children get eaten by carnivores. I kind of like it though. I wonder if he can grow up first. Nah, he's dead. <laughs> Maybe next year. And then here comes in the new fresh food. It leaves and comes back. We all know that a lot of carnivores is definitely the way. So as you can tell, for the most part, the gameplay is exhilarating uh, at all times. You never know what could happen. Alien could eat your fish. He's very close to eating my fish though. Please, oh, and he did it anyway. You're always on the edge. You never know. Aliens could pop out of nowhere. It's a game about patience. It's a game about skill. That's all it is. Patience and skill have both of them and you will defeat the insane aquariums you versus the aliens who will win Please don't take out any carnivores. I beg. All right. I think we're about to End this with a bit of a bang here. If only there was some way to kill my fish But that would be cruel, right? I guess I could just not feed them all. Nah, we'll be nice and there just like that We're out of the tank. Zorf the horse. Zorf gives you a hand in keeping your fish fed. Yay. Be like Pops out pellets out of his... I don't know how, but he does. Bonus round. Collect as many shells as you can. All right, here we go. All right, how does this work? All right, it's pretty much to give you arthritis again. So you use these shells for some other weird program on this game. I don't really remember how it works. You use to get the good ones. Get the good ones. Don't care about the small ones. Get the good ones. I want all the shells. They all belong to me. I worked hard for these shells. You didn't. 626 shells. I'll take it. She sells, she sells by... Bonus pet at 20k shells? Fam, did you see how many shells I got and how long that took? I never get in a bonus pet. Never. So yeah, just to show you, this is the new aquarium. It's cool, whatever. You get star catches. They catch stars. It's really nothing new. Wow, that we did it straight away. That's sick. Anyways, guys, that's all we've got time for here today. If you want to see more Saint Aquarium, let me know and we can revisit the world of insane aquariums. Hope you guys enjoyed. If you want to see more old school games, let me know in the like down below. And I'll catch you guys next time. Later, guys.